If you live in Richmond Hill, you most likely know Zach from sitting here on Ford Avenue right by the train tracks watching the trains go by. But as the coronavirus pandemic began and he had to stay home, his routine drastically changed. Zach needs the routine. Um, we found that over the last four months, things have been um, hard. They've been he's he struggled with with some focus and so school is not an option summer camp is not an option right now so we just one day decided that a job would be actually a good chance for building routine and consistency and some discipline and maybe some responsibility. Zach's mom, Erica, was nervous about finding her 21 year old autistic son a job because he needs to work with someone who has a lot of patience. One post on the Richmond Hill Community Facebook page later, and Zach had an interview at McDonald's within an hour, but also many other options of places to work. A good thing that someone once told me is that everybody has a role. Um, so we always try to find a role for uh, anybody with ability and treat them as family as well. Zach's in charge of sweeping and cleaning the lobby spotless, and he's not one to not pay attention to detail. Make sure I get every corner or most of it. He really responded well. He called me uh, Patrick Starfish his first day, which I, I loved his humor and um, just his ability to um, want to be a part of the team. And Zach's favorite part of having a job is something many of us also enjoy. Getting paid. <laughs> Erica says this might be the silver lining of the coronavirus pandemic for her family. I'm, I'm just especially, I'm just so grateful to everyone that's come alongside and people that have given him opportunities, people that have never met us, people that are just willing to, to take him right in without even actually meeting him, just knowing him from online, knowing his persona and just saying, hey, we love this kid, let's give him a chance. Reporting in Richmond Hill, Emma Hamilton, WJCL 22 News.